The clerical script, traditional Chinese, Li Shu simplified Chinese, Li Shu Pinyin, Li Shu, Japanese, Li Shu T Reishotai, Vietnamese, Latu, also formerly Chancery script, is an archaic style of Chinese calligraphy which evolved from the Warring States period to the Qin Dynasty, was dominant in the Han Dynasty, and remained in use through the Wei Jin periods. Due to its high legibility to modern readers, it is still used for artistic flavor in a variety of functional applications such as headlines, signboards, and advertisements. This legibility stems from the highly rectilinear structure, a feature shared with modern regular script Keishu. In structure and rectilinearity, it is generally similar to the modern script, however, in contrast with the tall to square modern script, it tends to be square to wide, and often has a pronounced, wave-like flaring of isolated major strokes, especially a dominant rightward or downward diagonal stroke. Some structures are also archaic. Origins Clerical script is popularly but mistakenly thought to have developed or been invented in the early Han dynasty from the small seal script. The process of change between small seal script and clerical script is referred to as the Livian lit clerical evolution. There are also historical traditions dating to the Han dynasty which mistakenly attributed the creation of clerical script to the Qin dynasty and in particular to Shang Miao, who is said to have invented it at the behest of Qin Shi Huang. Another traditional account is that it was invented by government scribes, in particular those involved in the justice and penal systems. However, from written materials unearthed by archaeologists, it is now known that all stages of Chinese writing underwent periods of natural evolution, and none of them were inventions by one person. This is true of clerical script as well. Furthermore, rather than being established by government scribes, it has been argued that clerical script was already in popular use, and the Qin dynasty use by scribes merely reflects this trend. Archaeological discoveries now clearly show that an immature form of clerical script, proto-clerical, was already developing in the state of Qin during the Warring States period, and into the early Western Han, this can be seen on a number of bamboo books unearthed recently. Furthermore, the writing immediately preceding clerical script was not merely seal script alone, rather, there was a coexistence of seal script, the at first dominant and formal style, alongside an increasingly popular but secondary form of vulgar, popular, or common writing, which was very roughly executed and which was generally rectilinear. The popularity of this vulgar writing grew as the use of writing itself became more widespread. The structures and style of many of the characters executed in this vulgar writing were similar or even identical to their later clerical script counterparts, leading some to conclude that proto-clerical, and therefore clerical, script evolved not from seal script but from the vulgar writing of Qin, which coexisted with seal script in warring states to Qin dynasty. The Qin bamboo script is a good example of this transition, having evolved from vulgar Qin writing and considered by some to constitute Qin clerical script. Name The etymology of the Chinese name for the script Li Shu, simplified Chinese, Li Shu traditional Chinese, Li Shu is uncertain. Li meant a slave or prisoner serving the state, and thus, some infer that the script was used in recording the affairs related to such slaves, while others infer that it was used by prisoners conscripted as scribes. Usage and further evolution during warring states, proto-clerical script emerged in casual, informal usage. During the Qin dynasty it appears to have also been used in some scribal capacity, but never in formal usage. Maturing into clerical script in the early Han, it soon became the dominant script for general purposes, while seal script remained in use for the most formal purposes such as some stelae, signet seals, name chops, and especially the titles of written works and stelae, some cursive was also in use at the time. At roughly the same time, the clerical script was used and inscribed onto many stelae which later influenced subsequent development of Chinese calligraphic styles. Out of clerical script, a new form then emerged in the middle of the Eastern Han Dynasty, which Chu 2000, p. 113 terms. Neo-clerical script, it was from this neo-clerical and from cursive that by late in the Eastern Han semi-cursive would then evolve, out of which then emerged the modern standard script. Thus, according to Chu, the evolution from clerical script to standard script was not a direct step as commonly supposed. Clerical script in computing 
Notes References Chu Zigui, 2000. Chinese Writing, Translation of Wen Zi Zhe Gai Lun by Mato and Norman. Early China Special Monograph Series No. 4. Berkeley, The Society for the Study of Early China and the Institute of East Asian Studies, University of California, Berkeley. ISBN 1-55729-071-7.